What's up guys, it is Watch Chris back with another news video and today we have news from Timex and the announcement of an automatic 70s inspired Marlin. Before we get into it, please don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell icon. It is super helpful for the channel and I very much appreciate it. So as I mentioned in the intro, Timex are back with a brand new Marlin. This is the Marlin Automatic. It's getting a cushion style 70s case. It's made with stainless steel and it comes in at 39 millimeters. So let's talk about some of the specs on this watch. 39 millimeters, they're calling it the Marlin Subdial Automatic. That subdial refers to the 24 hour subdial at the nine o'clock. This is a 39 millimeter watch with a nine millimeter thickness. These are coming on a strap currently. These get a mineral crystal and 50 meters of water resistance. Cushion case, as I mentioned, is inspired by 1970s watches. You can actually see the movement from the back. They did a good job with the case back. There is a Marlin that is etched on the back and also a little window that you can see that movement. Again, they put a mineral crystal on the back. There are three different versions. All three get a 24 hour sub dial at the nine o'clock. That gets a red hand. Also a railroad style minute track on the outer portion of the dial. All three get fence post hands and of course a date at three o'clock. There are two silver dial versions. Those silver dials just have two different handsets. One is a black handset, one is a blue handset. And then there's a third watch here out of the trio. That is a black dial. That black dial gets a white handset. I believe that the indices here are applied. The hands do have loom on them. And of course it says Timex right below the 12 o'clock. It also says automatic there. And then above the six o'clock index, it says Marlin. This is actually a very good looking watch, very inspired by the 1970s and obviously very affordable. So these are coming in at $269, which really isn't that bad considering this gets an eight series Miyota movement. I do wish of course that they put a sapphire crystal. I literally say that with almost every single Timex video that I do. Recently they've been using them. However, in a lot of their new watches, over the past few months, they have not for one reason or another. This is a good looking watch and the cases on here look like they are doing a combination of polishing and brushing. So this is not just a full polished case. It looks very 70s. Tell me what you guys think about this new Marlin down in the comments below. I wanna hear from you guys. Please also don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell icon. It is super helpful for the channel and I very much appreciate it. Please follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is watchchrisblog, all one word. I have some links in the description. Those links are to Amazon. If you click those links and buy anything, it helps support the channel. It doesn't cost you anything extra. However, I very much appreciate it. Anyway, guys, thank you for logging on. I'll catch you in the next video.